What's going on YouTube? I am Highway to Hill and uh, this is my bike Yamaha YZF R3. So this is going to be the final update on my roll-on brass coated chain. Uh, this is a X-ring change and uh, I just wanted to show you how the chain looks like right now. Uh, it has done 20,000 kilometers. I really expected it to last more than 20,000 kilometers but I think right now I have reached the end of life of this chain. Now why do I say that because I see these uh, typical symptoms that you usually see when the chain and sprocket is coming towards the end of his life. Uh, there is a lot of noise. You know the chain has become stiff at some places and I also pointed out in my last video that this X ring like you can see over, over here this X ring has broken at a, a few places. There is different slack you know at uh, different areas. <sighs> Let me see if I can show you. So slack over here. See now it's it's tight over here. It's loose at some places. It is tight at some places. See here it's a little bit loose. Here it's a little stiff. And uh, also there is a lot of wear and tear on the sprocket itself. You can see the tooth. Uh, they are losing its uh, shape. And and because of the because of that the chain is not properly sitting on the tooth right i'll i'll show you what i mean can you see can you see the gap over here the chain is also stiff and also the tooth is losing its shape and because of that the chain is not sitting entirely uh, you know on the sprocket see there is gap now if i press it see what happens see uh, because the chain has become stiff right You can hear some noise as well. You can see how it moves over here. So I got this chain for uh i got this chain from roll-on for about uh, 5650 rupees this was almost like a year ago and i think now the cost of this chain is around 6111 uh, rupees so they've increased the cost by 500 rupees but i think it's still value for money and it gives uh, you know 20,000 kilometers and that's all i need i have ordered another set of this uh, roll-on brass coated chain uh, i'm going to be installing that soon I did consider DID and some other chain and sprocket uh, assemblies but those are way too expensive those are at least double the cost uh, which is around uh, 12,000 rupees or something uh, this chain only costs 6,000 rupees and you get 20,000 kilometers out of it but don't, don't get me wrong I think DID chain is absolutely great if you're into performance uh, if you have like bigger bikes if you are doing uh, you know performance riding track days and all that then I think you should definitely go for DID but uh, my use case is pretty simple I'm just touring or just riding in and around the city during the weekends so for me uh, you know 6,000 bucks 20,000 kilometers that's all I need so I have ordered another set of this chain I did consider buying DID but uh, the cost is 12,000 bucks and uh, for 12,000 rupees, uh, it's not that uh, the chain will suddenly last, you know, 30, 40,000 kilometers. Maybe it lasts, I don't know, 22,500 kilometers or 25,000 kilometers at max. So I think uh, uh, that's not what I'm uh, willing to pay. Uh, so I'm going with this roll-on brass coated chain again. It will give me, I know it will give me 20,000 kilometers. Uh, it's not the greatest it's it has some issues like like i said earlier in my earlier one of my earlier, earlier videos that the x ring is breaking at uh, you know at some of the links at some three or four places the x ring broke off uh, and uh, because of that you could see you know it has become stiff the chain has become stiff at those places and it's not properly seating on the sprocket so I'll probably give this chain 7 out of 10 I think uh, but it's done the job and I'm going to be changing this soon. So I hope this was useful if, if you are evaluating you know to get chain for your bike 
uh, i hope uh, you know the videos this video and the earlier videos that i have made on the roll on brass coated chain i hope that was uh, useful to you and helped you in your uh, decision making so that's about it guys thank you so much for watching uh, i'm going to see you soon in the next video until then this is highway to hell and you ride safe ciao